SD-WAN, the big benefit for customers, especially in the enterprise, multiple sites or large networks, you are now unhandcuffed from the traditional telco conglomerates. SD-WAN allows transport to be a commodity. I can get an internet connection, I can get private connectivity, I can get hybrid of each. Some sites might need one link, some you want two or three for diversity or resiliency. In the past, we had a, a concept in networking that if you wanted everybody to be able to talk, you had to get a common underlying theme. You had to have an underlying network that was the same across the board. That's not the case with SD-WAN. It's just a commodity. SD-WAN creates an overlay regardless of who the carrier is or what the transport type is. And so that allows businesses to not only be more flexible, but it really forces carriers, the traditional telcos, to earn business. No longer is there a mentality of we're big and we have most of your sites on net and so you have to go with us. It is easy now for our end customers to demand the level of service, the level of customer service as well as network service from their carriers. SD-WAN not only enables that, but it also provides visibility of how those networks are performing and to be able to hold accountable for the first time, really, the giant national telco that in the past would give an excuse to a customer of it's testing clean from our side. And so when you're trying to pick the right SD-WAN, I think the, really the, the thing I always talk with customers about, there's not a right or wrong. There's no end all be all. It's what's the right SD-WAN for you. And that part of the time it's understanding what's important to you. Part of the time it's understanding what's important to your network, meaning how are applications going to perform differently? What applications do you have? How do they perform differently over internet versus private? What are the latency or jitter concerns that you have? And so CBTS really comes in and we try to understand not just the SD-WAN side, but I can't make an SD-WAN recommendation for the end customer if I don't understand their unique environment. We come in with that approach, not only because we are customer first, not only because uh, of the fact that you can't design a network without understanding the goals of the network, but also because we aren't tied to any existing legacy revenue. We aren't looking, CBTS, we wanna put the right network in place. We aren't worrying about protecting legacy MPLS networks or legacy internet connections on outdated copper infrastructure. CBTS is really focused at a client first mentality and that enables us to be faster and more agile, and truthfully, to be more of a trusted advisor for our customer than the traditional telcos.